Hello and welcome back to the building of the Ben Buckle Falcon. As you can see, I've now translated my calculations into the reality and the front bulkhead which you're looking at now um, has been cut out and the rear guide has been also cut out that holds the bearers in the required position. And I've added the one and a half degrees of right hand thrust in which isn't obvious at the front of the bearers, but is more obvious as one goes towards the rear, if I just move things round. Okay, now, it's sitting on the jig. There's only two pieces of the wood are glued in at the moment. There's actually, the bearers aren't glued in yet. Um, and I intend to only glue together the cross braces for the first poor proportion of the fuselage before it begins to taper in top and bottom and I'll let that dry thoroughly before I actually start putting the tapered pieces in as we move down so I'll pause it here and start the jigging up process and then we'll come back to see how it looks. And here we have it. This is the fuselage in the jig and I've now glued in all the cross pieces for the front part of the fuselage which is parallel. The part which is pull, will pull in at the back, I'll wait till this is thoroughly dry before beginning that process and I'll flip the whole fuselage over and put it flat in the jig to do that cutting the cross pieces in pairs I also intend putting um, a diagonal brace across these members because I, it's my view that for a tiny amount of weight I'll add substantially to the strength I also intend adding a hardwood cross beam here and I'm going to drill through here into the bearers and put a dough through there as well. Because I think that will just help tie everything and pull everything together. I'm really happy with that. It's gone together well. The jig, of course, makes for accuracy. And I'm quite confident that it will all come out nice and firm and square. Next stage, after this dries, I'll show you when it's flipped over and I start adding in the cross members for the taper. The first stage of gluing together the two halves is now completed with the parallel section of the front of the fuselage done. So I've flipped it over, put it back into the jig, made sure it's all square by lining up on this central line and now what I'm going to do is start to cut and put in the cross braces in the tapered part. And I'll cut those in pairs and glue them in. Then let it all set. And in the meantime, along the front section, I'm going to make some triangulated gussets from this half by quarter inch stock. And strengthen this forward area at all the joints between the sides and the cross braces. Not long now and I'll be lifting it off the board. Well now this is going to complete this video. Um, the cross bracing has been added. The gussets have been put in place which I'm sure will greatly strengthen the structure. I'll let that dry, take it off the board and then put the it's in on the upper cross bracing and then the next video is going to be adding the stringers and the upper section which will give the model its actual shape so thanks for watching if you can get flying get flying that's what this is all about if you can't pick up that model and knife and let's get creative thanks for watching stay tuned